Another advantage is that if we see hyperpigmentation around the area without changing the la settings of the laser, we can treat them, paint them over and make look darker before the treatment. The langectasia can be treated around the whole face without changing the settings. Of course, getting closer to the nose means more painful treatment. You should always keep the laser at a 90 degree angle towards the skin. This is the right way to hold it, perpendicular to the skin. Hyperpigmentation becomes darker and you can go on treating another part of the face. The langectasia disappears. You actually bring the blood to a boiling point without damaging the surrounding skin. The skin is left intact, which means that patients can use makeup immediately after the treatment if they want to. This is another treatment of facial telangiectasias. At the beginning, the treatment is made in a slow way. You should do so when using this kind of laser for the first time. It's perfectly tolerable and you can see that it is necessary to use only medium power of the machine. If you slow down, the patient feels absolutely no pain. Sometimes, according to patient's tolerability, you can speed up the treatment. You can either start from smaller or bigger vessels, it makes absolutely no difference. The end point is to see the langectasias disappear without any skin changes. There should be no change in its color. Another advantage is that if you see hyperpigmentations around the area, you can treat them without changing any setting of the machine and they become darker. Treating senile stains on dorsum of hands is very subtle. You have to treat the whole lesion either with a scanner or a 0.5 or 1.2 mm spot. You don't need the whole power of the machine. It depends on the speed of your movements. According to it, you use a much lower setting, thus diminishing the pain sensation for the patient. All treated lesions are much darker than the untreated ones. The pain should always be tolerable. If the patient reports an intolerable pain, it means that your settings are too high for that case and you should lower them. You shouldn't be worried by smoke because it comes from burning the hair shaft and has no consequences. Treating dermatofibromas is quite easy. The first stage is to make them turn darker and grey. The next stage is the ablative phase. You can speed up the treatment without any kind of anesthesia because the first stage when the lesion turns into grey is perfectly tolerable and you start ablation only after the necrosis when the feeling is not there anymore. The slow ablation goes on and it's obviously more aggressive than in other cases. However, as you will see, without changing a lot, you can go on into continuous wave mode. You could also treat the same lesions with a scanner.
selectivity of this wavelength is going to have no consequences to normochromic skin and it is going to turn the stains into a darker color that will eventually shade off after two weeks. You should not overlap your pulses because this may cause burns.